As you can see, it's got a few little tiny, tiny, tiny seams on it. Uh, nothing massive, uh, apart from this one down here. Um, so this you just that just tucks. So it's um, two and a half into a three inch, tiny little fifteen degree pie cut to kick it out. Straight three inch tube down, pie cut it around. Uh, so that's got about about two mils of clearance between that chassis rail there. Uh, we'll put some padding under there or something to stop it if it bounces up and that sort of stuff. It's nice and tight there to the rail. And then obviously it comes back down to the already built exhaust from the other day. Okay, so we've got the uh, the mandrel bend all, all set up in the uh, the vise. Uh, a bit of a rudimental back purge going on. So we've got uh, argon coming in through the wire valve, in through the bottom of this cling field here. So all the argon is rising up, pushing out all the additional oxygen, um, and then it's blanked off this side with a small hole for the air to escape. Uh, that's been purging for a couple of minutes now. So what we're going to do is I'm going to start start to weld. Basically, all that argon does is it's a it's a shielding gas, but on the inside. So what you see on the outside, the weld is then reflective on the inside. Otherwise, you end up with um, little clumps. Um, basically weakens the weld, doesn't look very nice, and you don't really want it in your exhaust system. So, right, I'm gonna crack on with weld. Okay, so that's the, uh, the left-hand bank fully welded up clearance in there literally a couple of mil millimetre perfect pie cuts up and around there boom job done Okay guys, so that is both the right and the left bank fabricated on the Mopri. Got a bit more colour this side. Switch to the uh, slightly larger cup. Thank you. 
for watching. Um, so uh, that's both the left and the right exhaust fabricated front to back on the Mode 3. Um, we have got some exciting news. So tomorrow, uh, is that the 10th, 10th of July? Yep, 10th of July, uh, we have the chassis inspector come in to tag the chassis. So finger across, all goes well. And uh, with any luck, we might get a bit of video. Uh, and then we'll have that all important tag. And we'll be putting it back together, ready to take down the strip. As always, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and check out our Facebook page, which is at JDH Racing, and our Instagram, which is at JDH Racing 94. Cheers, I'll do it for now.